Hi there, it's Jennifer. Today I wanted to share a tutorial on how to get the perfect blowout. Um, so I guess let's get started. First of all, I like to use these microfiber towels. I find that they are much better than a regular towel. Um, so I wrap my hair in it, sit for like 10 minutes, um, and then I just scrunch the bottom instead of rubbing it all over my head just to avoid frizziness. And then I sit for maybe another 10 minutes. I know it's time consuming, but you really don't want to start blow drying your hair on completely wet hair. And um, once it's kind of dried about 75% or so, then I'll just kind of finger comb my hair. My hair is short enough right now that it's really easy to finger comb. When it gets longer, I do have to brush it. But So just brush it through with my fingers. And then I'm just going to do a super quick oh, blow dry. I'll just blow dry it so it's almost completely dry. And then we'll move on to the next step. Okay, so the next step is, oh, and by the way, you, you always want to use your blow dryer on a medium heat setting. If you use it on a high setting, for myself anyways, I find that it's just steaming the hair and that causes more damage. So use it on a, on a medium heat setting and then it'll be good. Um, so then the next step is I'm going to section off my hair and I'm going to use this round brush to kind of straighten and curl and blow dry these brown brushes are great because they have all these little holes and that gets that lets the air go through and then the hair will dry faster so it's a little helpful to have one of these guys and I'm just gonna pin up my hair and go section by section straighten and curl and then we will continue on Okay, so I thought my camera was recording the next step, but it wasn't, so I guess I'll just stay. Um, so if you have cowlicks or just pieces that you missed, uh, for me, the back of my head, it always doesn't cooperate, um, then you can go ahead with the flat iron or curl curling iron and just kind of straighten out those pieces. Um, so yeah, I always have a cowlick here, and then say my bangs don't uh, entirely cooperate. So yeah, and then the final step, and this is the best one I like anyways, <laughs> is for me, I find it's a little flat now, and so we want to add some volume. So I use these great big um, round brushes, and we're just going to use a bow dryer, and just for most of the, the top of the head, and we're just going to um, get some great volume and go section by section. And for this, um, you can do it two ways. You can um, take a section. You could leave it like this. Use the blow dryer. 
and then hold it, let it cool just for a few seconds and then brush it out. Then you'll have some great volume or you can also uh, blow dry and then blow dry all the way to the ends of the hair. Either way, it gives really great volume. And that is pretty much it. All you need is your favorite products to make sure that your hair stays nice and straight and has lots of bounce. Um, and that's it. So I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you find it good, helpful. And if you have any other ideas, definitely leave it in the comments below. If you'd like to see any other tutorials, you can definitely check out my blog at beautyunder10.ca. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.